Tala, Roo. Today you enter as individuals, but you will leave here husband and wife, blending your lives, expanding your family, and embarking upon the grandest adventure of human interaction. The story of your life together is still yours to write. Marriage is founded upon sincerity and understanding, which leads to tolerance, confidence, and trust. It involves respect for each other's feelings and weaknesses and faults. You believe that those qualities which have attracted you both to each other can best be developed during a life spent together. A happy marriage will enable you to establish a home with love and stability, where your family and friends will always be welcome and will which be a base from which the influence of your shared. And we hope strengthened life today can extend. Every day you live, learn how to receive love with as much understanding as you give it. Find things within yourself then you can share them with each other. Do not fear this love. Have an open heart and a sincere mind. Be sincerely interested in each other's happiness. Be constant and consistent in your love. From this comes security and strength. All that we love deeply becomes part of us on this day of your marriage. Try to commit yourselves fully and freely to each other. The Bible has given us what may be the world's best definition of what it means to love. I'd like to share with you a well-known passage from 1 Corinthians 13 and offer it as a model for you for the new life you are creating here today. Love is patient and kind. It is never jealous. Love is never boastful or conceited. It is never rude or selfish. It does not take offense and is not resentful. Love takes no pleasure in other people's faults, but delights in the truth. It is always ready to excuse, to trust, to hope. It is always ready to endure whatever comes. True love does not come to an end. Love is the reason why this day was chosen by both of you to begin your lives together, and love is the reason why you both will give it with all of your hearts for the good of each other. Love is the reason that together you will become one in one hope, one in believing in life, one in sharing the coming years. Love is the reason why this day was chosen by you both to begin your lives together, and love is the reason why you both will give with all of your hearts the good of each other. Before you are joined in marriage, I am to remind you of the solemn and enduring nature of the relationship into which you are about to enter. Do you, Raul, take Tala to be your lawfully wedded wife from this day forward to have and to hold, forsaking all others for better or for worse, for richer and poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and cherish for as long as you both shall live? And to you, Tala, take Raul to be your lawfully wedded husband from this day forward and to have and to hold, forsaking all others for better and for worse, for richer and poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and cherish for as long as you both shall live. We have the rings. We have one here. Now I ask that God bless these rings that Raul and Tala will exchange as a symbol of their love and fidelity. May these rings be blessed as the symbol of this affectionate union. These two lives are now joined in one unbroken circle. Wherever they go, may they always return to one another in their togetherness. May these two find each other the love for which all men and women yearn. May they grow in understanding and in compassion. May the home which they establish together be such a place of sanctuary that many will find there a friend. May these rings 
on their fingers symbolize the touch of the spirit of the love in their hearts. Raul, in placing this ring on Tala's finger, repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. With this ring, I thee wed. And with all I am, with all I am. and all I have, I honor you. All right, Tala, in placing this ring on Raul's finger, repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. And with all I am and all I have, I honor you. Tala and Ruel, throughout this wedding ceremony, you have vowed to love and remain steadfast and loyal to one another as you stand before your friends and family. You have each formalized and sanctified your body by exchanging the wedding vows and rings. May your love be eternal and undying. As you begin your married life together, hold close to you the words that you have spoken to each other here today. Life isn't always an easy road, as you both know. Rely on your faith and in the promises you will make today to help you through those times. Ask God to grant you the gifts of caring and understanding in your life together, allowing that each may be to the other a source of strength in need, a counselor in times of uncertainty, a comfort in times of sorrow, and a companion in your joys. Tala and Raul have considered together in marriage before this company have pledged their faith and declared their unity and are now joined in mutual esteem and devotion. What God hath here joined together, let no one set asunder. By the authority vested in me by the state of Texas, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. (laughs) It is now my great honor to be the first to present Mr. and Mrs. Raul and Tala Diaz. <laughs> 